Hey guys, how's it going? Toby here, welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel, welcome back to the Striker Showdown, this is episode 4. The next episode is going to be the grand finale where we find out who is best in your team, fast or slow. So far, Lorente, 9 games, 12 goals, 8 assists, which to be fair, for FIFA 15, a player with 60 pace, that is actually awesome, like, that is so good. For FIFA 15 and Giovinco, 9 games, 11 goals, 5 assists. So it's slightly behind. Now, if you'd like to get yourself some coins, check the link in the description for the FIFA shop.co.uk, a fantastic service that's fully automated on both consoles, which means you get your coins instantly, 24 7. And we have a discount code called Toby10, which gets you a 10% of every single one of your orders if you pop that in at the checkout, which is really really awesome so this guy he's got a fairly low chemistry team it's got a pretty sweaty attacking side though like that is still a strong striking partnership De Rossi gets to start off with our first goal so unfortunately doesn't actually count and somehow somehow that's a penalty please tell me how like, I know my goalkeeper kind of kind of had to tackle him but that's all he could do like I don't I don't know what do you guys think is this or is this not a penalty he got the ball just follow through to get the player as well. I don't know, it's it's dodgy, it's a difficult one to tell. But nonetheless, I actually dove right this time and nothing happened. It was weird, I I don't even know. But, we're going to kick things off. Lorente is on the edge of the box, whips it in, and it does fall back down to Asamoah, who just decides to smack it into the back of the net, to be honest. So unfortunately, our first two goals have come from players that aren't Lorente or Giovinco, but Giovinco decides to end that and gets himself a goal, ending the game 3-1. This guy rage quit just at halftime, giving us 10 points in the season. And that means Lorente and Giovinco are now tied at 12 goals because Lorente, you messed up your opportunity, man. You're in the lead and now Giovinco has caught up 10 games, 12 goals apiece. The next episode is the grand finale where we find out who is best, fast or slow? And we're going to have to see if you guys want another version of this, like a new season. We could do tall, be short, and loads of other things. We go into second game. This guy had a pretty cool Ivory Coast team, and it had a really threatening, like, attacking force. Like, he had some genuinely decent players, and it was worrying. It was really, really worrying because there's a the sort of players that I kind of like the poachers, and if they get into the right position, they're going to score a goal. A nice little goal there from Castan, which I will not complain about one bit. But again, it's something that doesn't count towards our actual series. So we need players to get on the score sheet they're actually meant to be. And Lorente does just that, getting himself a goal, which is absolutely awesome. And for some reason, for some reason, I decide to start throwing. You guys know what I'm like. If you've seen any of my other series, you know that I am so good at throwing games. We almost threw that one. We were 3-0 up. It ends 3-2, which is far too close to my liking. I really, really was tense at the end. We won the title as well. And we go into our third and final game. And this guy has Ribri, Mkhitaryan at striker, Shakiri, Gundogan, loads of really, really solid players. So I didn't really have high hopes this one, but Lorente gets himself on the score sheet, scoring our first goal, which is pretty awesome. And then Giovinco running down the right-hand side. I kind of messed up. Like, I meant to do a heel chop, screwed it up, but we get the cross in, and Hamstick is there to bury it, to give us the second goal. A bit of a cushion as well, because this guy was genuinely really, really decent, and a lovely pass all the way over to Asamo, who is an incredible midfielder, whips it in, and we get the goal with Giovinco. So again, again, Giovinco and Lorente both get one goal, and that means they're tied for the grand finale. Three games left. In the final episode, we will see who is going to win, Giovinco or Lorente. Three points from that, and it is so, so close. 14 goals, 12 games, 8 assists from Lorente, and that is a pretty phenomenal record. Then, exactly the same with Giovinco. This is ridiculous. You couldn't have it any closer if we tried. I really hope you have enjoyed this episode if you have leave it like and subscribe for some more for myself but take care guys have an amazing day and goodbye